Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you probably one of the fastest ways to get ancient debris, which if you didn't know is how you make netherite. What you will need for this is at least I'd say some level of protection. You can just have leather, that's good enough. Night vision, you don't need night vision, but I've just brought that along so I can see. Beds is the main thing you need. You can use TNT, but beds is a lot cheaper. Um, although it does get fire. If you want to do it without getting fire in your explosion, use TNT, but if you just want to do it the cheap way, get beds. Then you'll need a diamond pick, because I think that's the only thing that can mine it. I would take some food with you, and that's about it. So, I've just been doing this right now, and I actually found, in literally five minutes, I found, was it six or something that, uh, ancient debris? So yeah, you also want to make a nether portal and so what you want to do first, I'm just going to show you where it is, uh, um, I think it's over here, did I make it? I made a tunnel somewhere about here. Uh, there. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna quickly show you why. Got all this fire. Wow, I don't know how all these hoglins spawned here. Oh no, I feel bad now. But yeah, so, um, what you wanna do for this is be at Y15, level 15, that's the best place to get it. You can get in other bits, but I'd say it's the best. And,. Yeah, so dig down in the nether to Y level 15. Um, so just put your coordinates on if you don't already have them on. And yeah, so in this first thing, what I got, in the first few seconds, I got three ancient debris. In the second one, I got none. And in the third, I got two. So that's five ancient debris I'm sure yeah I think it was just five ancient debris so yeah that was in only like a f few minutes so if you're doing this for ages you should get quite a lot so yeah first find a spot where you want to do this you can wear a gold helmet so they won't attack you um, I'm gonna do that because if you didn't know when you wear a gold helmet, they won't attack you. And also this cool feature I just figured out of. I don't know why they fight all the fighting. But that <laughs> they look up then. That's quite cool. And anyway, I'm gonna get away from here because it's noisy. So yeah, you want some sort of armor. Um doesn't need to be too well armor. Um you want, sorry about the noises of those hoglins and piglins, oh they're so noisy. You want, they won't let leave me away, will they? There. You want a diamond pick since I think that's the only one you could get, oh my goodness they won't go. And um, diamond pick and beds. So get a lot of beds. Oh, I just got rid of that there. But yeah, get a ton of beds. I bet when I do this, it's going to be, I can't find any ancient debris. These beds can be any color. I'm just going to use white. You need three wood planks and three wool to get, make a bed. You don't need to take food with you but I would recommend it because otherwise you may get a bit hungry. You can also take torches instead of night vision because night vision is expensive. 
So yeah, I'm just gonna get torches. Mm -hmm. But I don't really need them. The only main thing you need is um, beds. That's probably about enough. Yeah, so now, since I then I lost my pickaxe. Get that bread. Just any sort of food source is good enough. And a stack of torches. But yeah, if you don't want fire, I'll use soul torches, because why not? It's a new update. If you don't want fire, I would recommend TNT, because that doesn't leave any fire, so you're less likely to die. So I may die during this. I'll try not to, but it's going to be hard. And yeah, so as you can see, you won't attack me, because I have this on. So yeah, go to Y level 15, which on my position coordinates thing you can see when i go up that turns 19 18 so go down to 15 and i'm gonna do the thing i should never do dig straight down and i went too far of course okay there and now i'd make a space just to get started because yeah ancient debris also does not get blown up by anything which is really good means this won't blow up during this so don't worry you won't lose it so yeah I've made this now what you want to do is I'm gonna place some of these down they don't give much lighting do they uh, build a pro well take away seven blocks and then just about place a bed. Try not when you go in the bed, because as you know, when you sleep in the nether, it'll blow up. So when you go in the bed, try back away, because it'll give you damage. And yeah, that's why I need the damage I, armor and that enderman sign. And look, first time the ancient debris. Oh wow, I said I'd be cautious. And this enderman wants to kill me. Why? What did I do? Oh, this has not went well, has it? But yeah, first time I did not place that there. <laughs> I'm not faking it, but I'm going to block this off. Because Enderman thought I hurt him, which technically I did, you could say. But yeah, you can use the... Uh, you don't need to bring blocks because you could just use your netherrack to go across. So yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of fire, but... How many did I get here? The most you can get in one spot is three. So yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that bed because it's not like I need it too much, but I would get quite a lot of beds because you may need a lot on. I actually made my way into my last mine. Wow. Um, I'm gonna go this way. So Y level 15, make sure you're at it. I'm gonna get rid of this fire because I don't wanna fall into it. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Basically it's fine, can't do it. Please bed, ouchie, eat this. The annoying part is when there's gravel. So yeah, you may want to bring food that heals better. I'm actually probably going to die several times during this. So that's why you should bring a respawn anchor. So yeah, I'm going to quickly go into creative. And yeah, in the last video I said I didn't know how to do it. And the moment after that video I figured out how to do it. <laughs> so respawn anchor get that which I think you can make out of crying obsidian and then glowstone and each time you die one of those things will go and then then spawn set and in the overworld these will blow up if you do them enough and 
yeah so that's my spawn point set which is now good so I can go back in survival so yeah I'd recommend doing that if you do have the stuff to do it okay did I get anything here sometimes you can get unlucky sometimes you can wow I actually just placed that there I meant to place netherrack there um, but yeah, sometimes you can get lucky, sometimes you can get unlucky. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Y level 16. You can do it at 16, but I'm just going to try to stay at 15. Build a cross. I can probably get rid of that. Okay place a bed there isn't a real way to protect yourself because as soon as you try to stop it's already blown up but I'm scared ouch okay nearly fell in there none here I bet that's gonna be my luck in this video I'm gonna find no ancient the breeze but yeah you I would recommend going in a straight line but sometimes it's hard to and boom lava right there wow but I saw some ancient debris oh since I have glowstone why don't I just use this <laughs> okay I wouldn't recommend this it's just because this isn't actually uh Two ancient debris. Looking good. One. What happened to my other piece? Oh, I still chucked in the lava, didn't I? Did I actually? Wow. I knew that would happen. And I'm burning. <laughs> I don't really need these torches just for since the fire lights up enough. Okay. Now get some more beds. Place it down. Boom. So if you have diamond armor, you will not get as much damage, so. If you're rich in Minecraft, then this will be easier for you. And I just went into a cave mm -hmm. by accident. Hello. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, but <laughs> that's the only problem when you do lead into a cave. I mean, sometimes there can be ancient debris in it, but I mean, in my survival world, I'll probably need it, but not now. And 15. Okay, there. Now, across. Boom. Wait, I could do that further. Or not. Ouch. Uh, none here. Well, at least I don't think there is. Get some more beds. Let's use this grey one. Ouch. None here. So far we've got three. But in the thing I did earlier, I got five. So that would make up. Have I lost it? No, it was down here, wasn't it? Okay, and we're back. Let's do it again. Oh, I already did do it here. And yeah, this blackstone can also be useful. Actually very useful for building, so 
yeah, while you're at it, if you find any blackstone, I'd recommend taking it. Okay, get some more beds. Ouchie. Is there any here? Better because we've not found that much. But this is the rarest, like, stone sort of thing, so this is rarer than diamonds. So, if you don't find too much, don't blame me because it is a really rare block. Sometimes you can get lucky with finding it. Oh, more lava, wow. Wow, 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 wow. So yeah, you can just keep on doing this. The reason I'm still recording this is I kind of just want to prove that you can get a lot. But, <laughs> of course, this is going to be my luck. And my luck equals none. Okay, wow, well, we're getting really unlucky. Too close. There we go! Finally! Oh, after a lot. But yeah, this isn't too rare. It is rare, don't get me wrong. But. This won't take hours to find, like, three. Unless you get really unlucky, but I don't think that'll happen. Okay, now get some more beds. No, one heart. Oh yeah, and I'd also just consider picking up all the blocks you can. Not exactly netherrack, because you can get a lot of that, but say gold and blackstone and all of that. All those rare blocks. Well, they're not exactly rare, but still nice to have in your collection. Oh, damn. Okay, that's my boots gone. Now, the problem with this is I need to find my way back. <laughs> Although the big fiery holes give it away. But I'm going to place these torches. So, wait, it knows later me knows where I went. Okay, and I found my way back. Just gonna get rid of all this fire. Dig out a bit more. Ouchie. How's my armor doing? Nearly all gone. But yeah, if you do have better armor, I'd use it. Because it's kind of a little risky. I'm just using this to prove the point that you don't need better armor. We're not seeming to be that lucky today. <laughs> oh yes, just as I say that we find more. But yeah, we're still not doing 
too great, but this will take time and I feel this is gonna fall into lava, so I'm gonna block that off. Ouch. You. There we go, finally. If this falls in, I'll be... Oh, another piece there. I'll get that first. And wait for the lava to go. And yeah. Oh, another piece. Is there another? No, that was just three, but that is still good. Better than nothing, you know. Seven. Okay, so I'm gonna stop doing this up there since you probably get how to do this. I can show you how much you'll be able to make out of it. And there. Um, maybe I'm wrong, but I think I collected all of the ancient debris. Well, one that I threw in lava, so I had to. With this, I have 13 ancient debris. And I don't know how long I was doing that. Maybe half an hour. I don't really know. But you can smelt this. So taking some coal, we can put some in these. Oh, so just um, if you have furnaces at your house or anything, like Minecraft house, <laughs> no real house, but um, definitely need furnaces and you can either choose between a upgrade, like a smithing table or a crafting table. So yeah, I think that'll probably be enough of these filled i'll basically explain crafting table you have to craft all of the armor yourself but if you already have diamond armor and you don't need both armor then you can up put the diamond armor in put an ingot of netherite and it'll make it netherite armor which it keeps enchantment so if you had diamond armor i'd recommend that but if you don't like me um <laughs> Uh, you can just craft it yourself and you'll also need gold so yeah first we need to have this all into separate bits to put in separate furnaces I don't know if I have that much furnaces but Okay, so just put them all in, they all smell. You can either use like charcoal, wood, or whatever you use to smell, they all work. And I think it only cost one. And yeah, I did do that. So yeah, wait for them all to smell and Take them out. I think it's just normal time to smell. And once these are all out, I can get more. So you should get nether scraps, is what comes from them. And now I just have to put two of these in. So I think each one only comes with one scrap, which is a bit expensive but it's the best thing so it's got to be expensive but yeah take all of this out and i think that's all so yeah i don't know how much gold you'll need for this just if you have gold go ahead um i mean if you have 13 scraps then you just need 13 gold 
But yeah, so how you craft this is a scrap there, there, up and across. And then you get your gold ingots and fill in this bit. That gets you one. And now I'm going to put as much of these as I can in. And I'll have one missing, but then put three there and there. I got three nether ingots, so you can't... <laughs> that I was actually expecting to get more from that, but I guess that's it. Um, you can either make it all with this which is going to take absolutely ages um like it's going to be quite a while to get all of that or if you do have diamond armor um which i don't but i will in one second you yeah if you do have diamond armor you can put that in and upgrade it Oh, <laughs> and it only costs one, which means you don't get two sets, but if you had one more piece of ancient debris, you could get a full set, and that's if you still had this. So, yeah, <laughs> although my boots are diamond. Yeah, so if you do have diamond, you can upgrade it, it depends if you want to upgrade it or you can go the really expensive way and get every single piece one by one but yeah that's it for me i hope you did all enjoy this video um i know it was a bit of a long one um well i don't exactly know how long it was but yeah that is the fastest way to get netherite in the new 1.16 update and yeah, I've never said this, but uh, consider dropping this video a like and um, also suggest what videos you'd like me to do in the comments. So yeah, that is it for me. I hope you did all enjoy it and I will see you in the next one. Bye.